music that you play there? What is that? How do you call that folk music? <laughs> I think it was Studs Terkel who asked Big Bill Brunzi, did he consider his blues music to be folk music? And Big Bill says, well, uh, never heard, heard no horse. <laughs>
right, all right, all right. The show is Horses Sing None of It. My name is Ralph Litwin, and our guest today is a group of Latin American musicians known as Echo del Sur. Do I have the pronunciation right? That's correct. This is Jorge Gomez, leader of the band. Why don't you introduce the rest of the band to us? Okay, yeah. Uh, echo, echo the soul means echoes of the sound. And uh, we play music from different countries in Latin America, and in particular from the high plains in South America. Uh, we have my, my left side, we have uh, Leo Vera. He's the, actually the musical director of the group. Uh, he's from Chile, then uh, play, playing guitars uh, and other string instruments. On my right side, we have Fabricio uh, Hernandez from Ecuador, and he specializes in playing wind instruments and also string instruments from Ecuador. Then uh, playing percussions and vocals, we have Claudia from, from Chile. Welcome. Why don't you give us another tune? <clears throat> oh.
All right. The music is so beautifully arranged and the harmonies are so glorious. I just love it. This is the natural sound of the animals. The natural the, sound of the, the magic animals. sound of the animals. It is beautiful. Do you feel like sharing a little bit about what that song was about for those of our listeners, our viewers who do not speak Spanish? Um, yeah, sure. Uh, this song is called Masija de Barro. In English means um, uh, a pot of clay. And um, this is basically about, um, they explain how the Incas, the indigenous people in South America, um, what they, they used to do with those uh, big pots of clay. They used to bury their ancestors, their relatives, in those big pots. Um, and they uh, include in those pots, they put food, uh, because they believe in the in another life. So that was basically the story of the, of the song. Beautiful. Thank you. What would you like to do for us next? Hmm? Calambito. Well, we are going to go to Chile now. And this is called Calambito Semucano. We're going to play a different instrument now. right now. It's, this is called Kena, and it's the flute of the Andes.
Beautiful. We should tell folks how to find out more information about your group and your recordings. They can, they can email you at info at echodelsur.com and uh, there they can find out about your performances and your recordings and uh, they will notice on the website that uh, you often perform with up to seven members so if they want to catch a live show or hear the recording they'll hear a lot more than what they're hearing now which is beautiful altogether did we take a look at the recordings? Why don't you tell us about what you're getting ready to do? Okay, now what we're going to do is uh, we're going to play um, one of the most popular rhythms in South America. It's called uh, Sicuri. Um, what we're going to do here is um, uh, Samponia is an instrument that uh, the palm flutes is an instrument that consists of um, two rows. It's made of bamboo, um, and you need you need the two rows to play together. So you don't have you cannot play just this row by itself. You need to play both both the notes are on both uh, rows. So what we're going to do here, we're going to split um, the instrument, and we'll, I'm going to play a melody, and he's going to complement the other melody. So it's like answering each other. Un, dos, tres, y... I can't even imagine how much practice and rehearsal that must take. Ooh. It's a lot of years. <laughs> a lot of coordination. Yeah. And the breath control must be astounding. It takes a lot of, a lot of practice to do this. Some points. Tidy. How many more minutes we have? 
You have about six, six or seven minutes. Okay, so I'm going to play one more last song. And uh, again, this is uh, Echo del Sur playing music uh, from different Latin American regions, um, from South America. Uh, the instruments that we use, um, they are like about 5,000 years ago were created by the Incas. So we have more instruments. We have like bombo, and everybody knows the guitar. <laughs> um, charango, I know that's the uh, mandolin from the Andes. And this instrument was created by the Incas. When the Spaniards arrived to South America, they saw the guitar, and they, they created this instrument. Maybe you can tell more about it. Yes, also, and the first one were made with armadillo shell in the back. Uh -huh. The body of the instrument is uh, the shell of the armadillo, and now they made with with the woods, and it's a copy of the mandolin. Also, the tune is very close. And uh, another instrument we can show is the chachas. Those are the gold nails. To toe nails. Gold. Yeah. Gold nails. <laughs> and uh, we have the bombo. It's a bass drum. It's a carved tree trunk, and uh, with the skin of the goats. Now we're going to play a song called Xairiri del Ande. That's so Thank you so much for coming to share your music with us. Thank you. Really Thank you. Thank you for inviting us. Well, where are you based in, in this country? Well, we are, um, actually we have, uh, we, we live in the tri-state area. We, I'm from Pennsylvania. Leo and Claudia are from New York. He's from New Jersey. So, uh, Basically, we travel uh, a lot, and um, <laughs> to practice yeah, is um, we do some sacrifice. But we have to we have to practice to stay together, you know. Well, you sound great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, folks, check out www.echodelsur.com for more information about the music, and go out and see him play somewhere. Sure. Oh. Un, dos, tres, y... Paisajes color aguayo, tierra de gente morena, paisajes color aguayo. Tengo que llegar al pueblo, ahí me espera mi madre, tierra de gente morena, paisajes color aguayo, tierra de gente morena, paisajes color aguayo.
www.echodelsur.com for more information. Why don't you give us a little more of the tune? Just play one more tune. Okay, now let's go play a song from Venezuela. We are going to use uh, another string instrument. Uh, this is not part of the Andes. It's uh, more like 